I'm Marlana, and today's great idea for learning with your older toddler, well, it revolves all around color and how you and your child can learn about color as you experiment and explore art supplies. By 36 months, your child should be able to grip and manipulate um, out things like crayons and magic markers and also pipettes and spray bottles. And they should have experience exploring and manipulating a variety of sensory materials. And although a lot of children will just dive right in when you give them a big pile of shaving cream or the chance to make mud pies, other children might find that pool wet on their fingers kind of shocking and not comfortable. But don't worry, with gentle encouragement and repeated exposure, they might just blossom into your favorite abstract artist which is exactly what you want developmentally because by 36 months they should also begin to demonstrate self-expression with art supplies. So play and make art with your older toddler. The dollar store is a great place to stock up on art supplies. Ask them, what does it feel like when you put your hands in that finger paint? Show them how to roll out a Play-Doh snake. And if you're outside in the early morning or late evening, help them see that the sky isn't always blue. Help them see the pink and the orange and the purple in the sunrise or the sunset. And if they're playing with dot markers or another art supply and their grip is a little awkward, it's hard for a toddler to do that, then just gently show them how to correct their grip. And you might notice that this is a little bit how they're going to be holding a pencil someday. And if finger painting at the table is a little too messy for your taste, well, let them take that paint into the shower um, during bath time. They can paint the shower walls and then you can just rinse your toddler and their painting area off when everybody's done. And now for the fun part. Here are some great art supplies that you might not have thought of before. And I thought I would show you how to make a really quick and easy art smock. Um, with a bandana and a clothespin. Super quick and easy to put on and take off afterwards. Just throw it in the washer when you're done. And um, speaking of shaving cream, if you put some shaving cream inside a baggie and then add a little bit of food coloring, your child will have a great time with a little self-contained um, color mixing art experience. I'm putting in some red and blue. Then zip it closed and um, let your child smush those colors all together. And maybe they'll find some purple after a while. Um, one thing that's a lot of fun for kids is to have a big piece of aluminum foil. They can wad it up and then they can use it to make um, art if they dip it in some paint and then tap it around on their paper they're making some prints. A quick way to improvise a paintbrush is to use a clothespin, pick up a cotton ball with it and again they can kind of paint with it. Makeup sponges are also nice for painting and moving around some paint on paper. And one other fun thing to do is to make a sticky wall. You need a flat surface. You can, you can tape some contact paper right on your wall. I've taped it right onto this little portable board. And if you're talking about a single color, give them just all the same color to stick on their sticky wall. Or if you're feeling adventurous and want to learn other things, you can put different colored objects on then ask them what color is that bird and what color is that bird so go on out there get a little messy and have fun making colorful art projects with your older toddler thanks so much